now we are discussing the topic deletion in avl tree whenever we are going to delete a certain node from the avl then this is called the deletion in the avl after deletion balancing factor of any node may affect and tree may become unbalanced now to understand this first of all we are taking this diagram and we want to find out that whether this tree is avl or not now we know that all the leaf nodes are having the balancing factor as 0 now talking about the node 20 here on the left we are having one level on the right we are having one level so 1 minus 1 is 0 now talking about the node 40 here on the left hand side we are having level 1 level 2 so two levels are there on the right hand side we are having only one level so 2 minus 1 is 1 so here we know that the balancing factor for the avl tree should be equal to 0 1 or minus 1 for every node and if we check out all the nodes that all the nodes are having balancing factor 0 1 and minus 1 that means this is the balanced avl now if we are going to perform a operation in this balanced tree which is uh, let us suppose deleting a node 50 so we are deleting the node number 50 and we know that node number 50 is this one so if I am going to delete this node, then obviously balancing factor will change. So first of all, I am removing the previous balancing factors. So now we are going to delete the node number 50. That means this number 50 node will not be there into this specific tree. Now, if this node is not there, the balancing factor will change. So first of all, we are removing this node from this tree. Now find out the balancing factor. We know that all the leaves are having balancing factor, which is zero. Now talking about the node number 20. So on the left hand side, we are having one level. On the right, we are having one level. So one minus one, that is zero. So here the balancing factor is zero. Now we are going to find out the balancing factor of node number 40. On the left, we are having one level and two levels so two levels are there on the right we are having nothing because this node not exists now so two minus zero it will become two now check out whether this tree is still a balanced avl or not we know that balancing factor of every node should be zero one and minus one so if we check that zero is proper it is zero it is zero no problem but there we are having two so this two is a problem so that means this tree is not a balanced AVL. So this is no more the balanced AVL tree. This tree is becoming now the unbalanced AVL after deletion of the node number 50. So this tree is now become the unbalanced AVL tree. Now we are coming on the statement. It is saying that after deletion. So here we have deleted a node number 50. Balancing factor of any node. We can see that node number 40 here that balancing factor changed so may effect and tree may become unbalanced so there the tree is now unbalanced so here we are going to perform certain rotations so rotations are made on unbalanced tree to restore the balanced tree so we will perform certain rotations so that the tree which was balanced will be again retrieved back now to perform rotation the node is identified whose balancing factor is neither 0, 1 or minus 1 and which is the nearest ancestor to the deleted node on the path from deleted node to the root node. So the meaning is that to perform the rotation means whatever the rotation we want to perform in the tree, first of all we have to identify which one is the problematic node. Problematic node means which is not having the balancing factor 0, 1 and minus 1. And that should be the nearest ancestor of the deleted node. Means we know that which node is deleted. The node number 50 is deleted. So this one is the node number 50. And we know that this is the node which is deleted. From deleted node, this is the deleted node. To the root, towards the root we have to go. Now from the deleted towards the root we have to traverse back. And whosoever is the problematic node we has to find out there the tree is very small and there the root is the problem because we can see that this is the 2 
2 means it is not following the balancing factor formula so this node is the problematic node which is the 2 so this is the node from where the tree will be rotated that means in this case obviously the root is the problem that's why whole tree will be rotated but you assume that the tree is much bigger now if from the path from deleted to the root if any other node is a problem then only that particular area will be rotated so this is the deletion in the AVL that whenever we are going to insert a node and whenever the balancing vector tree become changed then we has to find out the defaulter and defaulter we will find out from deleted node toward the root node and from that defaulter node the tree will be rotated now we are discussing the topic under this which is the AVL rotations while deletion so whenever we delete some of the element from the AVL tree the tree become unbalanced then the rotations are applied so while deletion the rotations are applied are called the AVL rotations while deletions the rotations are classified as L or R depend upon whether deletion occur at the left or right subtree so there are two subtrees one is left and one is right if the deletion is performed on the left hand side then the L rotation is applied if the deletion is on the right hand side then it's the R rotation is applied these rotations are further classified so depending upon the value of balancing factor of the node where n is the root of left or right so depending upon the value of the root and root of that left of the right from where the node is deleted the L rotation is further classified into L0, L1 or L-1. Similarly, the R rotations are further classified as R0, R1 and R-1. So the formula is that whenever we are performing the deletion, the tree become unbalanced. Now we have to find out where is the problem. If deletion is applied on the left subtree, the L rotations will be applied. If deletion is performed on the right subtree, then R rotation will be applied. Now, while performing the rotation, what is the number on the root? Means the balancing factor of root will be taken. If the balancing factor of root is 0, then it will be L0. If it is 1, L1. If it is minus 1, it will be L minus 1. If no deleted is on the right, then what is the number on the right root? So that will be if it is 0, it will be R0. If it is 1, it will be R1. If it is minus 1, it will be R minus 1. So this way the rotation will be applied. So that is all about the AVL rotations while deletion.